Welcome back to The Monk Hunter for Masterclass Part 4, The Brain Grip. Now in the last class we talked about aiming and using your finger to help your brain recognize the line of the arrow with a slightly canted bow. Now we're going to take it a step further. Once you practice that finger idea for a while, you'll begin to settle into an intuitive understanding of aiming without really having to think about it. But now we need to trick the brain into think it's holding an actual bow. Now chances are, as I did, you are probably holding your grip like you do in other games with your finger over the trigger. This creates a disconnect between your brain and what it actually thinks it's seeing in the game. Here's the suggestion. Pull your grip down so you're holding the controller in the same grip as the bow and watch how that feels. Your brain is going to make an immediate connection and you're going to feel more powerful right off the bat. And if you've been practicing the aim, it should again feel natural to simply look at the target, point at it without pointing your finger and simply fire. So this minor but significant change in how you hold the controller will change the accuracy and power of your shots. Now you can do this in the main game as well, but in Siege of Heaven, obviously if you hold down that side button, there is no shield. So you can simulate the grip on the bow much more realistically. In the main game, do the same thing, but of course you're going to have to float your finger a bit so you don't pull the shield all the time. So this is step two. Once you feel you have your aim coming into focus without really trying, getting closer to intuitive targeting, change your grip and it will change the way the game feels and you will actually get even better. All right, thanks for watching and keep on keeping on.